Hi, right, families of Ghetto News for the Mary Lee and Dad's Queen of Mary and Lee. I'm on Chicago, the red line. As you can see, there's a lot of passport photos, and they're all Caucasians. Somebody left one, I guess, for me to have as a souvenir. So, you know, I remember when I was a teenager on 63rd and Halstead. You could get your uh, fake ID all day. All day. You see? You know, if you're a real counterfeiter, which I am not, never have been, I don't believe in breaking the law for real, because I don't believe crime pays. But if you are a, you know, real counterfeit person, you can see why I'm going so hard about my venture card that ends on the 31st and the changes that have been made and stuff. Because like I said, I knew a guy by the name of Charles and his family dealt in, you know, fake IDs and stuff. You understand what I'm saying? And I just did a video and for me to get off on Chicago and see this, you know, it's not a coincidence. Nothing happens in this world by mistake. So, you know. We're dealing with a lot of counterfeit people. You understand what I'm saying? You know, I used to hear a lot of that stuff while I was selling general merchandise, you know, people going to jail for um, uh, bad checks and things of that nature. Everybody know I always dealt in cash. You understand what I'm saying? For real. So, you know, I could see how I could become a victim of all this. You understand what I'm saying? Social networking all that survival oh, oh, oh I mean what's that souvenir photos <laughs> man y'all seen the movie uh, catch me if you can you understand what I'm saying so you know what we dealing with some imposters real talk it's your ghetto news reporter saying you know I'm to step your game up you know it's gonna be a bumpy ride I'm pretty sure but uh <laughs> We gonna ride it out and shit just like a jackass. And with that, peace.